Many first-time visitors to Japan are often surprised to learn that, as one of the world's most advanced industrialized nations, this relatively small Asian country also boasts a rich and fascinating history that dates back thousands of years. Much of this rich tradition has, despite wars and natural devastation, been preserved, and a visit to Japan is a memorable one. Welcome to the Globetrotter, where today, we will be looking over some of the must-see locations during your visit to the land of the rising sun. Before we get started with today's video, be sure to subscribe to the channel in order to stay tuned for even more content down the road. Number 10. Sapporo Hokkaido Located upon Japan's northernmost island, Hokkaido, the city of Sapporo offers many sights and attractions for visiting tourists. As the island's largest city, it's a hub of cultural activity, hosting many excellent events and festivals, a distinctive culinary style, a rich theatrical history, and plenty of museums, galleries, and parks. The focal point here is very much the city's attractive downtown area, the center of which is Odori Park, a large swath of green that's very pleasant to explore. From here, you can also access points of interest, such as the Sapporo TV Tower, as well as the city's famous aerial tramway, an easy walk away. The Mount Moiwa Ropeway will eventually get you to the summit's upper station, from where you can enjoy incredible views over the city, a real treat at night. The mountain is also the location of the Mount Moiwa Ski Resort, a popular winter destination, especially since the 1972 Winter Olympics were held in the city. And if you're arriving in winter, be sure to visit the Sapporo Snow Festival, held here each February and drawing in excess of 2 million revelers. Number 9. Osaka Castle Built in the year 1586 by famous Japanese warrior and politician Toyotomi Hideyoshi, Osaka Castle stood as the largest and most important fortress in the country at its time. Although it has been destroyed and rebuilt a number of times since, the present structure, constructed in 1931, remains faithful to the original design. Highlights of a visit include the huge 5-story, 42-meter-tall main tower, built on an imposing 14-meter-tall stone base, and home to a number of displays, detailing the history of the castle and the city. Be sure to visit the top floor for its superb views over Osaka, an especially attractive sight as the sun sets. Also of interest in Osaka Castle Park is the Hokoku Shrine. While Osaka's best-known temple, Shitenoji, is also worth visiting and dates back to AD 59. Notable as Japan's first Buddhist temple, this lovely shrine features a five-story pagoda, along with a number of other exquisitely decorated buildings, including the Golden Pavilion, with its fine statues and paintings, the lecture hall, and a lovely covered corridor, linking three of the site's gates. Number 8. The Island Shrine of Itsukushima Just a short ferry ride from mainland Hiroshima is the island of Miyajima, famous the world over as Japan's Shrine Island. Covering an area of 30 square kilometers in Hiroshima Bay, Miyajima is best known as the home of the Itsukushima Shrine, a Shinto temple dedicated to the princess daughters of the wind god Suzano. Dating from the 8th century, the majority of the shrine's buildings rise out of the waters of a small bay, supported only by piles. The effect at high tide is simply stunning, making these structures, including the famous Great Floating Gate, appear as if they're floating on water. Linked together by walkways and bridges, it's a fascinating place to explore. In particular, its larger halls, such as the exquisite Han Den, the Offerings Hall, the Prayer Hall, and the Hall of a Thousand Mats. Another notable feature is the Shrine Stage, where visitors are entertained with traditional dances and musical performances. Also worth exploring are the island's exquisite grounds and gardens, home to wild deer and numerous bird colonies. Number 7. The Tokyo Sky Tree Practically impossible to miss while visiting the nation's capital city, the Tokyo Sky Tree stands as a 634-meter-tall communications and observation tower that rises out of the city's Sumida district of Minato, all while striking the imposing shape of a space rocket. The tower not only holds the title of the country's tallest structure, but also the tallest freestanding tower across the globe. The Tokyo Sky Tree was opened in 2012 and has quickly become one of the city's most visited tourist attractions, thanks to the incredible panoramic views from its restaurant and observation decks. With the base design in the form of a massive tripod, the tower includes a number of cylindrical observation levels, including one at the 350-meter mark and another at the 450-meter point, which includes a unique glass spiral walkway to an even higher viewpoint, with glass floors for those with strong stomachs. Be sure to also check out the smaller and much older Tokyo Tower, built in 1958 and once the city's tallest structure. Number 6. Fukuoka Castle and the City's Ancient Festivals 
One of the few surviving examples of the once prolific and majestic hilltop homes preferred by shoguns and city rulers, Fukuoka Castle is one of the highlights of a visit to Fukuoka. Once part of a massive complex that covered an area of some 47,000 square meters, this beautiful castle still impresses with its size and its position on a tall foundation overlooking the Naka River. Fukuoka is also well known for its many events and festivals, in particular the Hakata Gion Yamakasa, a famous two-week-long 700-year-old celebration held each July that draws millions of visitors from across the country to its colorful parades as well as its traditional races and costumes. The city is not without its modern attractions too, including Canal City Hakata, a city within the city, complete with a canal running through the complex along with great shops, hotels, restaurants, and a theater. Number 5. The Atsuda Shrine, Nagoya The Atsuda Shrine, in the heart of the city of Nagoya, is the most important Shinto shrine in Japan and attracts more than 5 million visitors each year. Established in the first century, this religious site is famous for its preserved imperial insignia, the grass mowing sword, one of only three in the country. Also of interest are its principal shrine, Hongu, surrounded by an enclosing wall, and the treasury with its numerous works of art, including old and modern paintings, ceramics, jewelry, and traditional masks. While in Nagoya, be sure to also visit Nagoya Castle, a splendid moated complex built in 1612, boasting a 48-meter-high main tower that is famous for its two gilded dolphins, its museum containing art treasures from the former palace, and its spectacular views over the city and the Nobi Plain. Number 4. Mount Fuji Without a doubt one of Japan's most recognizable landmarks, the majestic Mount Fuji also stands as the country's highest mountain peak towering a staggering 3,776 meters tall. This mountain is a massive departure from the otherwise largely flat landscape to the south and east, so much so that Mount Fuji is an ever-present icon within the distant horizon for those located in Tokyo, a distance that is more than 100 kilometers away. Mount Fuji has for centuries been celebrated in art and literature and is now considered so important an icon that UNESCO recognized its world cultural significance in 2013. Part of the Fuji Hakone Izu National Park, Mount Fuji is climbed by more than a million people each summer as an act of pilgrimage, which culminates in watching the sunrise from its summit. While some still choose to begin their climb from the base, the majority of climbers now start from above the halfway mark at the fifth station, resulting in a more manageable six or so hour ascent. Of course, for many, simply viewing the mountain from the distance or from the comfort of a speeding train can still be more than enough of an experience without having to embark on the long trek throughout the mountain. Number 3. Historic Kyoto One of Japan's most visited cities, lovely Kyoto, one of the few cities in the country to be spared the devastation of World War II, attracts more than 10 million visitors annually to explore its fine old streets and architecture, much of it unchanged since the imperial family took up residence here more than a thousand years ago. Even then, the city was Japan's most important cultural center, a legacy that continues with its many museums and art galleries, each bursting with important sculptures, paintings, and other art forms. Highlights of Kyoto's Buddhist-influenced architecture include its many well-preserved temples, 30 of which are still in use, and important structures, such as the 14th-century Golden Pavilion, famous for its exquisite gold-leaf-clad exterior. Be sure to also visit Nijo Castle, a 17th-century fortress that has retained its original walls, towers, and moat, its beautiful gates, and its palace with fine interior decor. Also worth a visit is the original Kyoto Imperial Palace, built in AD 794 and one of the city's most visited historic sites. Finally, no visit to Kyoto is complete without spending time exploring the Arashiyama Bamboo Grove, a beautiful area of tall bamboo, just a few minutes' walk from the town center. Number 2. Imperial Tokyo Tokyo's most famous landmark, the Imperial Palace with its beautiful 17th-century parks, surrounded by walls and moats, is a must-see if you happen to be visiting the nation's capital. However, do keep in mind that much of the palace is closed to the public. That is due to it still being used in part by the Imperial family. But a stroll around the exquisite palace grounds is still more than enough to take the breath away from new visitors. The Imperial Palace stands on the site where, in 1457, the feudal Lord Ota Dokan built the first fortress the focal point from which the city of Tokyo, or Edo back in that time, would gradually spread out from. In addition to the many fine views of the palace from numerous points in and around the parkland, such as the famous Nijubashi Bridge, or Double Bridge, so named for its watery reflection, visitors are permitted into the East Higashi Gyoen Garden and other areas that are open to the public as part of an organized tour. 
When you're done with the tour, you may wish to venture off to the famous Ginza Shopping District in order to catch a show at either the Kabuki Za Theater or Shimabashi Inbujo Theater, both renowned for their traditional dance performances. Number 1. Chubu Sangaku National Park and the Japanese Alps Japan boasts a number of outstanding areas of natural beauty, many of them designated as national parks or, in some cases, UNESCO World Heritage Sites. One of the country's most spectacular parks is Chubu Sangaku National Park, in the center of Honshu. The location incorporates the northern and central regions within a group of mountains, collectively referred to as the Hida Mountains, or the Japanese Alps. The region contains some of the highest peaks in the country, including Hotaka at 3,190 meters and Yari at 3,180 meters. Similar in many ways to the Alps of Central Europe, both in the character of the landscape and in its abundance of snow in winter, the Japanese Alps attract large numbers of walkers and climbers in summer and skiers in winter. Of particular interest is the park's abundance of flora and fauna, including the rare ptarmigan and mountain antelopes found at higher altitudes. The park's many hot springs also draw visitors and led to the development of various spas and holiday resorts, the best known being Kamikochi. With its abundance of activities and beautiful sights, along with the year-long allure, it's no wonder as to why the Japanese Alps are listed upon many travelers' itinerary. We hope you enjoyed this look into some of the attractions and destinations you can expect while visiting the traditional yet modernizing Japan. Do you agree with our list of locations? Have any recommendations or destinations you'd prefer to have seen? Let us know down in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button in order to know when new videos and lists come out.